Tangier Marina Bay International, Tangier Marina, also known as Tanger Marina or Tangier Marina, is a luxury marina and residential development located in the city of Tangier. The marina features state-of-the-art facilities and services, including a yacht club, restaurants and bars, shops and many other amenities. The marina is also home to a number of restaurants, cafes and shops. The Royal Yacht Club of Tangier, or YCT, is a prestigious yacht club located in the coastal city of Tangier, Morocco. The club offers a range of services and amenities for yacht owners and enthusiasts, including mooring facilities, a restaurant and bar, and a swimming pool. The RYCT also hosts sailing events and regattas throughout the year. 2023 Yopa U21 World Championship, Tangier, Morocco, Tangier, Morocco, the day started cloudy, with rain showers coming and going over the race course in the city of Tangier. The sea conditions were slightly different today as there was. A swell from the northwest and the wind from the southwest. The wind conditions were quite unstable across the race course, as the wind at the start line was more substantial than at Mark 1, which was significantly weaker. The wind intensity ranged from 6 knots at the top marks and up to 12 knots at the start line, with gusts up to 15 knots. In the first race of the day, the ILC A6 fleet had three starting procedures starting with a general recall, followed by a cancelled start due to a wind shift, and a final good start under a black flag. 
The ILC A6 first race was the outer course. With Josephine Higard from Denmark arriving first to mark one, the race was very close until the last moment when the race was won by Italian Emma Mativi. In the second race, the winner was again Emma Mativi nonetheless. With one discard after four races, the top female sailor was Josephine Higard. In the male ILC A7 Yellow Fleet, the racing was tight, and each sailor demonstrated their skill and expertise. In the very technical swell and shifty conditions, in race one, the first place went to Italian Atilio Borio, and in race to Haruto Kuroda from Japan took the top spot. In the Blue Fleet, Finley Dickinson of United Kingdom won both races of the day. As the sun descended, all the clouds vanished, making way for a serene, clear afternoon. After sailing, the sailors gathered for complimentary pasta and an array of mouth-watering toppings at the Boat Park restaurant. The combination of the aroma of freshly cooked pasta and the picture-perfect backdrop of Tangier made for an exhilarating experience for all sailors. It highlighted a sense of togetherness, a unique hallmark of the sailing community. The delightful food has become a cherished tradition for sailors at the venue, a treat they eagerly anticipate. The sailors couldn't help but express their gratitude for this thoughtful and delicious treat. Organizing partners are the Royal Yacht Club de Tangier and Tangier Sailing, in conjunction with the ILCA. Tangier is home to the U21 ILCA World Championship Royal Yachting Club of Tangier, is organizing the U21 World Championship ILCA for the first time in Morocco. This prestigious international competition will take place between October 15th and 22nd, 2023 in Tangier. The Moroccan national team will have 11 boys ILCA 7 and 2 girls ILCA 6. It is made up of O3 nautical clubs, CNM are of Casablanca, ACYCM of Mohammedia and Rasid of Tangier. This event is considered one of the main stages of preparation and concentration of the national team selected to represent the Kingdom of Morocco during the African Championship is a qualifier for the Paris 2024 Olympic Games and which will be played in Egypt from December 1 to 10, 2023. The national team is made up mainly of athletes from the Royal Marine Nautical Club Kase Bala, Zinapuris and Safasabrine. The national team is preparing to join other courses next November. Note that Morocco has never had the opportunity to qualify for the Olympic Games in this discipline, particularly due to an almost absent sailing federation. 